Well, hello folks, how are we doing? Another video for me, uh, it's a midweek video, and different surroundings today, different camera, I'm just using my phone actually for this, because uh, my GoPro is at home. In the week I tend to be uh, either in a B&B or staying in the caravan, maybe it's in the air. But uh, it's an unboxing video, I've got a box here, I've just taken the seal off. I'm just going to show you what's inside, uh, I'm going to open it together and have a look at what's in there. So, let me just swing around on the chair. Okay, right first off, before I open it properly, batteries. This is a bit of a hint uh, of what some of the things will be that I bought, so uh, keep you guessing while we're looking through together. Get rid of a bit of uh, packaging. Okay, firstly, let's have a look. Okay, we've got, got these lights in here. <laughs> right, I bought these because, um, sorry, I'll tell you what I'm laughing at in a moment. I bought some of these because the silica broke, snapped off this week, so I needed some more lights. So they come in pairs, £7. And check this brand name out. <laughs> I don't know where they gave me these names up, but it must be random. It looks like a capture. Look at that, WJ, uh, sorry, WQJIFV. Wow. Yeah, okay. <laughs> it's not quite radar, is it? WQJIFE. It makes me laugh. Anyway, so yeah, rechargeable LED bike uh, tail light. Let's have a look. 50 lumens, it says. This is for the commuter bike, really, but it comes in two, so uh, I'll be able to transfer one of those onto my road bike. Um, it actually just reminds me because the uh, days are getting a bit longer now, aren't they? So hopefully you know, three or four weeks from now, I'll be getting home and it'll be light still. But um, you never know. Might need to take them a little bit longer than that. Um, now, I have actually bought a light for a road bike as well. And that's what the batteries are for. Uh, it takes, I think it's two uh, AAA batteries. So this is a Cati Omni 5. I've actually got one of these already. Um, I've actually had one of these already. It fell off my bike, commute, on the commuter bike, coming home one time, hit the ground, smashed it into pieces. Uh, it wasn't um, it wasn't fitted to the bike properly, so it came off. Now, I actually used the other one of these, my first one of these, for Paris Best Paris. And uh, with it taking batteries, it's brilliant. Uh, it makes me wonder why they, you can buy USB ones, because these last all night for, day, you know, for days on end, but... I guess most people are quite happy having rechargeable lights because they don't cycle all through the night. Only people like me who are a bit mental who just keep cycling from, <laughs> or, you know, uh, four o'clock in the evening till six o'clock in the morning sometimes. So, yeah, brilliant. I'm going to get that on the road bike. It's probably moving out there. So, what else we've got inside here? Right, okay. There's a theme to these next few items. Um, tire levers, park tool tire levers. I actually, uh, I'm actually down to one lever now. Can't find any of me, me park tool ones, so I've bought some more. Uh, and as you can see, patches as well. So that was at three pound fifty or something like that. So I've got that. Now most of these things are bought in preparation for the transcontinental race as is this one as well, part tool. It's a TB2, an emergency boot, emergency tyre boot. Dead easy to use. I've been watching a few videos on uh, YouTube getting get myself uh, familiar with how to use them. Uh, cause I must say, it's something I've never used, but uh, that small, I can pack that away quite easily. So literally, if you get a big gash in your tyre, all you do is take one of those out and it covers the, it covers the hole, uh, it covers the slit or whatever, uh, however you've damaged it. Gets you to the bike shop. Next up, park tool. Here we go. Some hex. It's a hex tool. Uh, quite a few sizes, I think. Uh, 1.52, 2.5, 3, 4, 5, and 6 millimeter. Chromium, chrome vandium tool set. So it's hex wrenches from park tool. Again, on the repair theme. Uh, finally, in here. Uh, Got now. <laughs> I'd wanted to buy a part. I tried to buy a part to one, but 
but Amazon won't let me uh, purchase it. It won't they don't sell to send to uh, UK citizens. So it makes you wonder why the hell it's on there. And there was loads of those. So I eventually found this this one risk. Now what this little uh, gizmo is, I don't know why I call it a gizmo, it's not electronic. Uh, this little tool, it's a, a valve core remover. Uh, I bought this because, um, okay, transcontinental race, is 4,000 kilometers. So what I plan to do before before I go, and I might practice it uh, in advance as well, I'm gonna buy a uh, tube sealant. Uh, I'm gonna basically use this tool to take the valve off and then you pump the sealant into the tube. Uh, a bit of a preventive measure against uh, punctures. Uh, so I'm gonna do that and get a small bottle of sealant as well. Um, I, I don't know, four ounces or something like that. So those together as a, as a remedy to, well, not a remedy, as a preventive measure of getting there, you know, stopping punctures, that sort of thing. So lastly, I thought I bought more than this actually, uh, some clothing. Let's just open this. Now, um, this has got strange letters, but this looks like, this, that looks decidedly uh, Polish to me. So, it's from Przewodniczący. I don't know. <laughs> oh, there we go. I'll, I'll show you that that's it. it, make you, it make you come to your own conclusions how that's pronounced. And um, it's a sleeveless mesh base layer. Um, I do quite sweat a lot. Um, at this particular time of year when I'm not quite sure what I'm going to be wearing because the weather uh, changes so much. I mean like this morning for instance on the commute to work it was actually uh, pretty cold. It was about one degree in the morning. Coming back it was more like ten. <laughs> And uh, I had a base layer one, it was a full base layer. I didn't realise when I finished work it was going to be so mild. So, a simple mesh one, sleeveless like this, uh, is going to suit me down to the ground. So, that's it. That's all the things I got this week. So, a bit of clothing, lots of lights for both bikes, and lots of repair tools as well. So, I uh, hope you enjoyed this video, a little bit different. Um, I will be out this weekend, I think, if the weather's good, for a video. Uh, a vlog number 100. I'm not going to count this one. This we're going to count this as a half. This is 99 and a half because um, I like to, <laughs> I like to count up um, on when I'm actually out and about on the roads. So uh, yeah, we're going to have to plan something uh, special for it. I might run a competition. Uh, I'll let you know on Saturday or Sunday, whichever day I go out. So uh, for me, take care. Hope you enjoy. What's left of your week? It's Thursday as we're recording this, so um, yeah, when the weekend is just around the corner. It's payday as well, so <laughs> hence why I bought things from the bike. So uh, for me, take care. Uh, before I go, don't forget to hit uh, the subscribe button, and if you want to find out what's uh, coming, well, well, find out when I'm publishing videos to my channel. Don't forget to hit the uh, bell notification icon as well. So uh, perhaps give it a thumbs up. So for me, take care. I'll see you in the next video. See you later. Bye-bye.